हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज़ आवर फर्स्ट लेसन ऑफ द कोर्स नाइट्रोजन मेटाबॉलिज्म इन प्लांट्स सो इट इज़ प्रेजेंटेड बाय मी अपराजिता शंघार सो लेट्स स्टार्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स सी व्हाट इज़ द सिग्निफिकेंस ऑफ नाइट्रोजन एज वी नो दैट देयर इज अबाउट 78 परसेंट ऑफ नाइट्रोजन विच इज प्रजेंट इन इन आवर एटमोसफियर बाय वॉल्यूम बट दिस नाइट्रोजन कैन नॉट बी यूज बाय द प्लांट्स डायरेक्टली so it must be converted into some usable form so first from atmosphere it goes into the soil where it is converted into some usable form by some microorganism and when it is converted into the usable form then it is utilized by the plants then let's see what are the importance of nitrogen in plants first of all it is involved in the synthesis of protein secondly it is also involved in the formation of protoplasm nucleic acid purines pyrimidine bases chlorophyll alkaloids and many more coenzymes if there occurs the deficiency of nitrogen then it may cause chlorosis what is chlorosis chlorosis is the yellowing of leaves so deficiency may leads to chlorosis and also the deficiency of nitrogen may leads to the reduction in cell division cell growth so ultimately reduction in plant growth late flowering may occur and many more other complexities may also arise so let's see what is the need of nitrogen fixation why the molecular nitrogen cannot be used directly because as we know that in atmosphere the nitrogen exist as in the triply bonded diatomic form means there is nitrogen nitrogen triple bond which makes the nitrogen the di nitrogen relatively inert due to this inertness it cannot easily react with other chemicals to form new compound that's why in the process of nitrogen fixation these two atoms get freeze from their triply bonded diatomic forms there are few exceptions few organisms that can use this nitrogen directly these are some insectivorous plants certain bacteria blue green algae and few fungi but otherwise in most of the cases plant need to fix nitrogen before they can utilize it then what is nitrogen fixation for the understanding we can simply say that it is a chemical process by which the non usable form of nitrogen which is molecular nitrogen is converted into more reactive usable forms like ammonia more systematically we can say that nitrogen fixation is a process by which the nitrogen in the earth atmosphere is converted into ammonia or other molecules available to living organisms Then let's see what are the various methods of nitrogen fixation. It has been categorized into two: the non-biological type of nitrogen fixation and biological kind of nitrogen fixation. The non-biological nitrogen fixation is further categorized into the industrial and atmospheric nitrogen fixation. And the biological one is categorized into the symbiotic and non-symbiotic nitrogen fixation. So let's see uh, first what is atmospheric nitrogen fixation. In the process of uh, atmospheric nitrogen fixation, what happens? That it takes place uh, in the presence of phenomena like lightning and thundering, which occurs in atmosphere. So uh, in atmospheric nitrogen fixation by photochemical and electrochemical reactions, first of all, what happens? That uh, this di nitrogen combines with oxygen to gives no nitric oxide this further combines with oxygen to give no2 nitrogen dioxide this nitrogen dioxide react with water molecule to give nitric acid and nitrous acid and these nitric acid and nitrous acid 
in the uh, converts then lose the hydrogen ion and forms the nitrate and nitrite respectively means from nitric acid nitrates are formed and from nitrous acid nitrites ion are formed and these nitrates and nitrites can be used by the plants but not the molecular nitrogen so what happened here ultimately that the dinitrogen has been converted into the nitrates and nitrites this was atmospheric nitrogen fixation then comes to industrial nitrogen fixation what is industrial nitrogen fixation is also known by the name haber process on the name of its uh, discoverer and also known as haber bosch process and it is an artificial nitrogen fixation process and uh, nowadays it is uh, main industrial procedure for the production of ammonia before uh, this uh, process uh, was uh, discovered there was uh, the production of ammonia was not so easy what happens uh, in this process the molecular nitrogen combines with hydrogen using a metal catalyst means nitrogen combines with hydrogen using a metal catalyst under high pressure and temperature to give ammonia here we can see in the reaction that nitrogen is combining with hydrogen and the ammonia is formed but most important what we have to remember that there is a requirement of high temperature and pressure and metal gas catalyst should be there so it uh, was the completion of non biological kind of nitrogen fixation in the coming class in we will discuss about biological nitrogen fixation so this is the end of this lesson and uh, we will proceed further with the biological nitrogen fixation thank you very much have a nice